This is a Game Caviar production. Not having it in the Game Caviar Studios showing you some The Last of Us gameplay I played online with my uh, fellow clan mates from Skull and Bones clan. This was Sunday, I believe it was, and we had a great time. We played for about an hour or so, 45 minutes to an hour, maybe more than an hour. I lose track of time. Anyway, online is still fun. This game overall is still a masterpiece. It's going to be amazing. And uh, just uh, enjoy the video. I know there's no sound in the video. And I need to figure out how, somehow, when I use my official PlayStation Bluetooth headset, blah, 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 it cuts the sound from the TV and it only directs it into the uh, the headset. So I need to dig into the settings and figure out how I can um, how I can stop that from happening. I fixed it before, but apparently it reverted back to its uh, normal douchebag setting. Anyway, the uh, site GameCaviar.com has recently went over 10,000 views. I'm really happy about that. Thank you for all your support. If you haven't bookmarked that site yet, please do so, GameCaviar.com. It has all the hotness on it. And I recently got my 2013 Game Caviar t-shirt in the mail. And I will tell you that the quality on that t-shirt is amazing. And it is absolutely, uh, it absolutely beat my expectations. So go to uh, Zazzle.com slash not having it and pick up your own personal 2013 game caviar t-shirt you can also edit it to put your name on the the back of the t-shirt or whatever you want to put on it and uh just to show your love and add some customization also for all you guys who have the uh, iphone 5 there is a a uh, iphone 5 game caviar case on there which you can pick up too if you uh, want to that'd be awesome if you did but uh but yeah i just want to let you guys know about the the current situation in game caviar i am currently downloading ncaa football 14 so be prepared to see some videos on that now i don't really necessarily like madden i don't know how the new madden is gonna uh come out the Madden 25 but i do like the ncaa uh, football games i have always been a fan of those games so i think uh once i get into it I would ideally like to take a team and, uh, you know, build it up, do my scouting and whatnot, and win national championships. It'd be awesome if they would let you build your own team, like name your own team from scratch. I know they let you do that in past games, and uh, but I don't know whether they'll let you do that in this particular game. I hope so. Fingers crossed. Anyway, uh, so what's up with you guys, man? Let me know. What you guys have been going on? What's been going on with you guys, especially you guys with channels? And uh, uh, let me know how that's been going on. A lot of people have been asking me about the uh, partnership with Zoom and Games, and hopefully, uh, the video that I posted a while ago has uh, helped out a lot of people. I know it's helped out some, but I want that video to continue to to grow in views so people can understand what they're getting into when you when you accept a partnership for Zoom and Games. A lot of people have said that. They don't, uh, well, Zoom and Games doesn't really help your channel grow. And, uh, you know, like I said in that video, it's a give and take thing, man. You know, they, they, they let you keep your 80 20. So, um, I, you know, it's, it's what it, whatever you want for your channel. Me personally, uh, I like the features that go along with being partnered with a network. Like, I don't have to wait to monetize my videos, the monetization is instant. And I'm not really looking to cash in off YouTube videos. But at, at the same time, if it happened, that'd be awesome. But I, I'm more of just getting my getting the videos out there and growing the channel and meeting new people and doing it that way. So I'm not necessarily in it for just the money. Now, the money is awesome. I have gotten paid from Zoom and Games. So uh, for if anybody who had a question about that, I can I can tell you that I I have personally got paid by Zoom and Games so that that's not a problem for me, and uh, every time I email them or or send them a message on Twitter they are really quick and responding to those uh, messages that I send them so it's a it's a give and take and I don't necessarily know that whether whether they will evolve or not throughout the uh, the year because like i said they're they're pretty much they're pretty new as far as uh partnership 
goes and, and being a, a, a network that offers partnerships. So they can always add features. Yeah, they, I mean, they can whenever they want to. And I don't know whether they're planning on doing it or not, but I know for my channel and myself right now, everything that, that I've experienced has been positive. So uh, for those of you who are looking to partner with a network, uh, let me know. I mean, ask me any question you want to know about Zoom and Games, either on this video or the past video that I did about Zoom and Games. Um, I will link it to this video, put it as a video response, and I'll give you any help that I that I can as far as helping you throughout that process. Um, but yeah, that's just a quick update of Game Caviar and everything that's been going on. And uh, let me see, what else have I seen? I've seen a couple new movies, man. I've seen uh, I've seen Pacific Rim, and uh, I really need to start doing like movie reviews because I see a lot of movies. I, I I go to the movies pretty regularly, and I'm always watching movies. So Pacific Rim was okay. I really didn't um, enjoy it, but uh, I didn't enjoy it as much as a lot of people have. But uh. I, I'm used to, like, when I was still in high school, I was watching, like, Gundam Wing and everything like that. So, if you're like me and you like Gundam and you think that you're going to get something like that in Pacific Rim, it's not quite the same. I don't, I didn't like the two-pilot system, but the way they explained it in the movies, I, I understand it. And it um it works for the movie, but at the same time, it's like, you know, it's, kind, it's still kind of dumb. But anyway, um... Hit me up in the comments box and we can have discussions on whatever. This has been The Last of Us on PS3. I'm not having it in the Game Caviar Studios. And I'm out. This has been a Game Caviar production. Like this video and subscribe for more.